What's going on guys? This is Pikachu OTC from Simple Trade and welcome to another video in which I'll be reviewing the company UBQU. Now before we get started, I already reviewed this company back at around the weekly review too. So if you're not familiar with the backstory of this company and their product, make sure to go and watch the video and then return here and see it from this point onward. Now let's talk about what happened here on September 21st. The stock was traded at the triple zero nothing. How could that be? The reason for that is the SEC deadline. The company had no filings whatsoever and they were at a risk of delisting to the expert market. So people just dumped their shares. But on September 21st, the company uploaded an annual report and right after that, they uploaded the attorney letter and one day later, they got the yield signed. So they were not on the delisting risk and a lot of volume came in as you can see about 1.2 billion volume in one day the stock got up from the triple zero three to the triple zero five and overall did about 400 percent run from the triple zero one to the triple zero five in two days with very nice volume which is very very good and after that consolidation for around one to two months and now let's talk about what happened here what happened at the recent days and what can we expect from the company in the near future so on November 1st, the company opened a new Twitter account and tweeted, this is the official corporate account for OTC Pink UBQU. Now you might ask, how can we be sure that this is the actual official Twitter? Well, you can go to the OTC markets and click the Twitter right here. And this will send you to the older Twitter of UBQU and they retweeted that tweet. So this can make us sure that this is in fact the current ubqu twitter account furthermore you can see more tweets from the company light at the end of the tunnel on getting current with exciting news ahead stay tuned so now we know that there will be news sometimes in the near future also the company ubqu uploaded a training letter yesterday getting closer and ubqu is excited about our development with the gdet and the dream card opportunities more to come now, how is GDT related to UBQU? Well, the answer to that is that UBQU CEO is the new appointed CEO of GDET. And if they are excited about their development with GDET and the dream card opportunities, this might suggest that there will be some sort of collaboration or that UBQU is entering the crypto sector. That's how I find this tweet very, very interesting. And lastly, you can see that the company uploaded the latest quarterly report and also uploaded the attorney letter and they should get the pin current information stamp in just a couple of days and after they get the pink sign they will probably release the news that they were talking about in their twitter account one more thing about the company is the float of the company you can see this is a very heavy stock this is a 20 billion float company however that does not necessarily mean that the stock cannot go up we've seen this on many stocks before we covered phil just a couple of days ago that stock is 25 billion float and currently sitting at the double zero seventy area so don't let that flow intimidate you but it does mean that we will need a lot of volume for the stock to go up or down and finally i want to show you an article from 2017 saying that the hemp cannabis product sales projected to hit one billion dollars in three years and you can see right here that the top five online brands are cw hemp plus cbd oil hemp meds elixinol and Canaz all now Canaz all are UBQU so if UBQU are placed top five in the world with online brands this means that this company has an actual product and if they are now entering the crypto sector it will be very interesting to see what this company will bring in the near future so that was it about UBQU I hope you enjoyed if you did make sure to drop a like comment down below subscribe to the channel hit the bell notification button so you don't miss the future videos also if you're not on our discord channel yet make sure to go to the description and join we alerted UBQU the second that the new Twitter was out so you don't want to miss these kind of runners or potential future runners once again thank you for joining and I'll see you on the next video